Main scene loaded. Yes, that means we're live. Uh, this is a spontaneous random Monday stream. So, uh, streaming addict. Well, I'm a VR addict. It just so happens that streaming is now part of all my VR gameplay. So, uh, that's happening. This is uh, Eye of the Temple, first steps. And uh, I'm running Live Mixed Reality with, uh, with an avatar. This is a room scale game. Hello, Jeb. Welcome to the hol Holo Bolo. Is that Danish for some curse word stuff? Who knows? Who knows? But um, this is pretty neat. Yeah. <laughs> it seems to cache messages that are done offline. It's really weird. Um, continue or new game. I can't remember. I have eight minutes in this before, but uh, let's start a new game. I've turned off all my overlays to have the immersion, but live. I don't know how to get live to be gone, so who knows. Before you start, please pay attention to the following inf following instructions. In this game, you will be stepping from one block to another with your own feet. This is a bit. This is a bit. I can see the first steps logo. I mean, in the <laughs> in the full game, this will be fine because the logo kind of stops before the info box. Depends on your height, though. But right now, it's text on top of text with transparency. That that's that's not helpful. Yeah. In this game, you will be stepping from one block to another with your own feet. Step when blocks are lining up. Do not attempt to jump over gaps. When a block starts moving, you may feel like you are almost losing your balance. Stand firmly on your feet. Do not lean on walls in the game for support. Yes. There is a small risk of actually losing your balance and falling over. Play at your own risk. Disclaimer, yeah. Your whip will automatically uncurl at places where you may need it. At those places, you will be near the center of your play area, so you have proper room to use the whip. This is something people comment on, and like, you're always in the middle, actually. So that's a bit funny. The game has been free. The game has frequent checkpoints that save your progress. Uh, take breaks. You can stop playing anytime and continue later. Birdie birdie. Is my headset on straight? It seems like it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, am I supposed to? St okay. There we go. So this is an interesting game because the live camera is managed by the game. Uh, it's not a camera setting in in live. It's uh, completely driven by the the game and the SDK We need games that can scan your place virtual walls and on top of the real wall so you can actually lean against them <laughs> Well, yeah So yes, the, I am not entirely unassociated with this game, but almost um, for s Somehow I was invited to a game jam at the Unity headquarters in Copenhagen and was on uh, Rune's uh, team when he actually made a prototype for this, but I have no No other involvement in the actual game development. No So this this is entirely based on your room scale movement So you need to stand on different platforms and stuff There we go. I haven't played this in a long time now, I feel like. There's just way too many games to blow. Yeah. Don't break the old invaluable <laughs> the old invaluable vases. I mean if I'm a treasure hunter and adventurer, I break all all the things. Now you get a whip. Uh, did I hit it too far down? Whoops. Welcome, Mr. Boo. Yes, now today we're finally playing a bit of uh, Eye of the Temple. This is the free demo. It's freely available to anyone and everyone. Um, and you can play it uh, if you have 2x2 two two meters. That is the physical requirements. 
And now you need to I need to walk physically backwards to not <laughs> I stepped off my platform. Shh. Uh that is clearly closed. Let's not go let's not go there. Um there's another lever. Uh that's a gong thing. Let's let's do this one. Yeah. Did I miss those? Damn it. Uh let's do that later, if I remember. This might be a really short demo. I can't actually remember. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, wait, wait. Can I st Right, 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 right. So here they actually go into the same place and... Uh, like, just imagine the amount of planning this kind of level design takes. Doesn't it take a lot of physical space if you have to move backwards on those? The, the thing is, you always move into the middle with all these trickery things. Or, I mean, you step away and then you move into the middle with them. Um, the whole game is meant to be for you to be able to step around if you have two by two meters. Yeah. Wait, what am I actually doing here? Oh, sh crap! I should have a lit torch here, damn it! Uh... Where do I get a lit torch? I don't even know. Yeah, so this is where having a wireless system would be awesome. It is a very neat concept. This has, uh, again, the prototype was made in early 2016. So Rune has been at this for uh, quite some time. Hello, birdie. Oop, that was easy. That opened the gate. Uh, I should do some more testing with this. Problem is when you're used to streaming. Yes, 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 yes. Bradley, this has even the most modern live integration. With, you know, fake lighting and, uh, and stuff. Ooh. I guess the birds are there to direct your attention towards what you triggered. Uh, maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Freaking insanity in a good way. Oh, I went back too far. Damn it. That's what happened when I read chat apparently <laughs> Oh, maybe I should have turned on always on TTS today. Damn it Forgot I don't have an easy way to toggle that feature now. Damn it. At some point I will allow moderators to toggle that feature with a slash command Yeah Yeah, per set. Why are you tiptoeing? Oh, is the calibration off? <laughs> Dang it! Uh, I'm just gonna grab... It's sneaky here because you get the whip for the lever, but also... You can smash the... the... the urns. Um, yep, and now sounds like this. Uh-oh, he's changing his voice. Shocking. Um, we can check. If, uh, I mean, let's see. Wobo said, just the left foot. Let's see. Yep, Calibrate. but now sounds like this. Let's see. At some point, uh, this will be nicer because I would have, you know, the, the Tundra trackers, hopefully. Go away, Liv. Um... Which... Wait, 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 I was never on it. Dang it. Um, yeah, the... The old... Uh, the old vibe trackers all uh, bounce around on my feet. It doesn't really help with calibration or nice, nice visuals. Uh-oh. Uh, I feel like I should have have seen fire somewhere. Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, no, no! <laughs> no! I'm pretty sure I will go back. Uh, maybe. Shh! Freaking, freaking gems all over the place. Oh no, no, no! Okay, I'm maybe not going back. <laughs> Wobo now sounds like this. 
not prepared for that. Wait, is everyone... Everyone wants to be an Australian. But that would it's too lifelike. I mean, what's the problem with being too lifelike? Oh, I didn't break it. There we go. I mean, this is what... This is what we should have... <laughs> I stepped on my cable. Yes. Wait. Oh. Wobo now sounds like this. Yep, I said. For feet, it would probably be worth sacrificing precision to compensate for small fast bumps. That would have to be implemented in live, though. Yeah. I think I get uh, this amazing living creation. Right. Do you see, yeah, the game is actually moving the yep, camera. Yep, I said. Why did it ignore my voice? Clearly, you, you screwed up your voice. <laughs> I don't know, man. It goes to default if if it's somehow broken. Oh crap! Jetpack oh, oh. now sounds like this. Ow! Do we get a reset point? Crap! Yeah, you need to. I think I think uh, you can set your crouch height. Jetpack yeah. said, "Does it respect my voice now?" Nobody respects you, Jep. Don't. Don't go there. Um. <laughs> uh, never mind. Oop. This is an interestingly small place. Wait, wait, wait. I was supposed to do that there? I can't... Whoa! I... Wobo said, what do crystals do? Just I'm, score? I'm... Not actually sure. <laughs> Jeppe said, might be... I will have to report this incident in our secret, talking behind <laughs> Bowl's back corner. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, it's, uh, I've been told that on Jep's Discord. Uh, there's actually a secret channel where they talk shit about me and my channel. So that's, that, that's, that's nice. <laughs> but yes, yes, Mr. Bradman. You should see this when there's actually a dynamic lighting around. The the um, it's it's kind of bonkers. Oh, oh, hello. That's one out of two. Um guess I'm going this way. Yeah, me and navigation are not friends. I'm I'm really bad at that. <coughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Wait, wait, wait. This is. Oh, 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 oh. I'm trying to convert Brad Chan to VRM. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, so I can use it with live, but things have been messing up hard. I haven't figured out why. Wobo now sounds almost. like this. Yeah, I. Uh, it surprised me when not everyone's is, is exactly the same. I want photorealistic avatar bodies. Uh, <laughs> I mean, aren't there like Kickstarters and things for that? It's just that you need you need to have the capture equipment. So it's probably it's often an, an on-site an on-site process to actually get photorealistic avatars. Um, so you'll stand in you know a 360 camera or whatever scanning facility. Ooh. Boop. Yep, I said, I should get my 3D scan fixed up so I can have a ME avatar. Yes, of course. <laughs> You're a disgusting avatar. <laughs> uh, I think the this is a quite old avatar yep, now. Yep, I said, why did it reset my voice again now? I don't know. I think it might be... I think I might have one, a problem when people... Yep, I said. Your TTS is broken. Shut up. But yes, I think it's the... I've seen this behavior, but I haven't been able to uh, replicate it. 
Uh, Liv is venture funded. Said, there might be a conflict between us. Yeah, I, I think I have problems with it writing the configuration file and clearly clearly Vubu murders you. <laughs> this this is neat. Um, Liv now sounds like this. Oh damn it, not Danish again. Shit. So you have these beams from the center rock. Which should help with the yeah, virtual it, motion. I guess I'll just be Danish from now on then. Ah! I got it! Well, yeah, let's do that again. Shit. Sadly, yeah. it's Bradley said, beam erect. <laughs> Wobo said, let's see what I sound <laughs> like now then. Yeah, everyone's voice is breaking. Apparently only one person is now saved. Shit. And, and Mr. Cold, you said you had good voices already, so there is no beta. There is no YouTube beta. That's now skipped. Yes. There we go. High pressure. <sighs> okay, watch a minute. Yes. Yep, is making all the stuff. New area, the atrium. You can see all the... Uh, oh, there's fire over there. You can see all the gems that will appear. I don't think I've seen a... a below me. No, yes. Oh! You mean you know your voice settings? <gasps> I'm not sure why my settings are freaky again. I've the tried VR to... The VR realm subbed for money. Oh. <laughs> Sub for... You even subbed for money. <laughs> Holy shit. Thanks, Paul, for resubbing. Thank you for supporting the channel. So I can waste my money on weird stuff. Yeah. Oof. I'm still using the... Oh, the dusters. Money more like prime. Wait, was that a Prime subscription? Prime subscriptions are supposed to have a separate voice. That is, in that case, in that case, friggin' uh, Streamlabs doesn't work. Because it's supposed to differentiate. You, it, you did it wrong, Paul. You don't get money when you soup. You lose money. <laughs> what? Huh. That is actually the fault of Streamlabs, because Streamlabs is supposed to have different notifications for Prime subs and, uh, you know, normally paid for subs. Wait, this doesn't go? Just use another VTuber program, the VM program. It's fine, it's live, that's the problem. <laughs> I mean, go and go and report it on... Uh, that needs to say, get to the job. Uh, um... Go to the live Discord. Yeah, they're very, very responsive yeah, when it comes to things. Shop, huh? There we go. I don't think that get to the chopper worked that well. Um, yeah. Oh, oh, I can light, light my torch. Ah! Light my torch, damn it! Crap. I'm gonna go back and light my torch. Yeah, be said, I'll be back. <laughs> Yes. I have not done me command or anything yet. There we go. Dynamic lighting. I think I get some frame rate drops. <laughs> no. My oh, shit. Nope. That one worked well. <laughs> I'm. I have planned to add Amazon voice support because they have a few. You whoosh! me command. Oh shit! That was my joystick. <clears throat> as long as my controllers are fine, yeah, it looks fine. Hello. Damn it. Bunk. Uh, 
Jeppe sagde, please don't break your place. Clearly. This is... It's been so long since I played an actual room scale game that, you know, things have been creeping into my space, which is becoming in very apparent. Yes, I got to keep my burning torch. Right. Ooh. Let's try to focus. Shit, this is at the edge of my bloody platform. It's horrifying to step off the edge and like... Feel like you're gonna fall. Horrible. <laughs> yeah, my freaking my freaking floor platform is exactly Wilbo two by two said, meters. That is why I will not dare play this until I get a new apartment. Yeah. <laughs> I'm. Yeah, I, I need to clean up before I play this. Uh, access in full game only, so we can't get out to the fire flower thingy. Yeah, the live beta has a quest mix reality feature now. Yep. They also have a stabilized VR view option, which I only noticed just before going live. And I'm curious to try that out. So they have an alternative to the official VR view with uh, stabilization with options. Yoop, 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 yoop. That is in the labs features in Live. Problem is then you need to run Live all the friggin' time. <laughs> uh, uh. Too much power. Um, Unity still seems like... I mean... If a game is really taxing, I don't want to run live. Because it still... It boots so slowly. It feels like it it's loading in tons of resources. I don't know if that's actually the case. But that's how it feels. Shit, my... The torch went out. Damn it. Ugh. <sighs> I'm haven't been over there, so let's let's go check it out, I guess. Yes. That's oh holy shit. That's far down. Jeppe said, "I don't think Liu takes much performance as long as you don't start the Liu compositor." Yeah. Uh, yeah, maybe maybe I can just run live without the yeah without the compositor. That's true. I will try it out at some point for sure and then I should run the game that I've already been playing so I can compare the performance log with FPS VR yeah 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 yeah, yeah. seems like a reasonable thing to do because uh, then I, I will have what the oh no that's the oh shit I already went around now <laughs> I missed Nern there Right, so the exit was on the side. That exit, I could... Shit. I've derped it. Let's see. Boop. I saw that Climbing recently added uh, bending toes for the feet in in, in Climbing, which has a native tracker support. Holy shit. <gasps> oh. The friggin' edge of the platform. It's matching too well with the friggin' friggin' things. My my That's never gonna stop being a problem unless un until I get a very bigger space and a bigger bigger EVA mat. <laughs> Your toy is now pitch black. Um there we can do this. Uh, let's see. Boink. Is it less pitch black now? I'm gonna... No, I don't wanna go there. Let's go back into the darkness again. Does this game support feed trackers? You can lean without falling. Mm, well, not really. But I think it's quite lenient on the actual falling part. Uh... I see. Uh, it's still very dark. <laughs> I switched to bright, but um, clearly it doesn't care. Uh, bright. Is there an apply button? I don't think so. I'll keep it at this and we'll see if it becomes too bright when going outdoors. 
think uh, I think someone said that bright was the better mode to use anyway. Mm. Here we see a railroad. Whoa. I do have access to the full game because I'm a tester. Oh, I shouldn't have. G oh, wait. No, 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 no. Okay, let's go up again. But I can't. I can't stream the full game, obviously, because it's unreleased as of yet. So that would, you know, that would be really bad. <laughs> There's something that I should probably light on fire as well. This is clearly a uh, point where uh, things should exist, which is not in the demo, maybe. I wish SteamVR added native avatar support. Live feels too delicate. Looking at you, Ragnarok. <laughs> well, Ragnarok, they said that it's actually a uh, an engine an engine problem. So Unreal, because it's an Unreal game. I don't know. I just hope that you know Unreal will be. F I want to play more Ragnarok in mixed reality. Actually, I I <laughs> I hope they fix it soonish. But again. They're kind of all blaming each other at this point. What? Whoa. Uh. Ah. <laughs> uh. Why? What? <laughs> it felt like a missing lever over there. I don't know how that works. Can I? Can I let my? Uh, let's try that over here. Uh. The whip doesn't burn. I'm wondering how to get the fire over there. Um, might have missed something. I mean, what what's up with the freaking freaking lever thing over there? Hmm. I'm not sure how far you're supposed to be able to get in this demo. I'm gonna go down again and check if I missed anything. Like, can I, can I, can I dip my whip in in oil and have it burn? I don't know. Oh, that's that's a distance off. That's why I never did anything with it. Right. Hmm. I feel like this has to do with the railroad. There's probably a, a cart and... Oh, yeah, the stick has been cut off. <laughs> Let's see. Um, shit. Oh, there's a cart. All the way down there. Hmm. Yeah, I have not been riding the cart yet. Um, I know, it's shameful I haven't played this more. Even if I have access to it, but I mean, that's the thing. I know how 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 cool the interaction is and how cool mixed reality is, especially if you know if you use a camera, it's even more insane because you're actually walking in comparison to many other mi mixed reality games that uh, you just float around standing still. Uh. So yeah, it would be really neat to uh, stream the whole game. You know, without knowing what comes next. Uh, wait, was that what was on the other side? Was that for my whip? I guess let's go check. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, oh, I, I hid, I hid <laughs> FPS VR, and that was my watch. Now I have no watch. I can't tell what the time is. <laughs> Crap. Let's see. Yeah. I guess I'm completely black now again. It's a bit annoying. I'm guessing the game might not actually have a light level, but this is the ambient. I'm not sure how the fake lighting actually works. If it's analyzing, it's actually getting lighting data from the game itself through the SDK. My cable is, oh, it's all twisted now. Shit. 
<laughs> I know some of the things that come further along in the in, <laughs> in this world and some things are quite quite terrifying. And yes, playing this wirelessly would be highly beneficial. I do have the Y wireless, but I don't think I want to sacrifice the image quality and stuff of the index. That's kind of why I bought it in the first place. I can I can hardly imagine going back. Right. Oh, oof. I could have just gone back and lit the shit. This will probably unlock something that I just have ignored until now. So let's do this. Bloop. Oh, it turns it. Right. Suddenly things make more sense. <laughs> I went all the way to the other side for nothing. New area, Eastern Outlook. <laughs> yeah, I need to untwist my cable now. Turning off FPS VR was a bad idea. Oh, oh, hello. So I'm now running the bright mode. Is it too bright when I'm outdoors? I wonder. Spinny, spinny, spinny. I thought this demo would already be over, so I'm kind of surprised. <laughs> right, so... There are things to do on that side. That's blocked. That's blocked. Is that... Can I... I can turn this while on it. Right. There's a lever over there. And that cl that's closed. So I... I oh, that's... This is a bad idea. Ow! Apparently I wasn't fast enough. Right, let's go all the way over and then do the lever over there. Yeah. Yeah, this is when I want to move to a freaking warehouse. Maybe hang the cable from above. <laughs> Oh crap. Keep forgetting there's gems. That toggles the doors. Okay, that's interesting. Wait, that means Wait, how... <laughs> damn it. That freaking thing in the middle needs to actually be in the opposite direction so the Ugh. Well, let's do that. At least I get that one. Yeah. Puzzles. Highly physical puzzles because it changes where you move and how you move. Well, maybe not how, but... Oop, wrong hand. Oh, crap. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, this is probably the most realistic whip you'll ever see in a VR game, or <laughs> right currently in a VR game anyway. Your left leg is broken again. Well, oh, shit. Crap. <laughs> Ugh. I see my cable in the way. Oh, it might be that I think these belts are really bad. Like the straps, I think it's spinning. Like, yeah, it's totally loose. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's happening. It's not sliding off my foot or anything, but it's spinning. This is also why we want the freaking Tundra Trackers, because with the belt straps, they can't spin. Because they're attached with loops. 
Holy shit, the the in internal screw for this is completely it's it's just spinning. <laughs> Stupid trackers. Why only a tripod socket? That's a you know curiosity. I guess I guess I have two cheap two cheap uh, foot things because I could have the stabilizing pin to actually not spin them. I'm gonna do this again. It's spinning freely, so it will go out of sync anyway. But this will work for the moment. Yes. You also get quite the foot jiggle with these big trackers on your feet. And I think with a tripod mount, they're even offset further out, so the weight is is like a distance off your foot. Yeah, I'm looking forward to Tundra Tracker, but bloody bloody September. Let's let's observe what this does. Oh sh! <laughs> well, that was easy to observe. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that there is an eye on the friggin' wall there probably means that yes, hello. To actually have to lean out to not get pushed off. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Conveniently placed fire. I do feel my frame rate. I think with mixed reality and uh, stereoscopic rendering and all that, it's a bit intense for my GPU, even. Even if I have a 3080. <laughs> Mixed reality, holy crap. Yeah, it's murdering your performance. Is this the room I was in before? I think so, yeah. Now I'm now... I've gone all the way around and now heading into this direction. <laughs> the East Passage. I... <laughs> now I'm seeing it from behind. <laughs> oh shit! These freaking spikes. There's spikes all over the place. Uh, I think this is a one-way street. Sh shit. Oh, that's really dark. I'm gonna be a freaking black shadow. Even if I run on bright mode. I do have a torch. Um, that just... Oh, it, it doesn't burn for the longest time. <laughs> for, for a very long time. I think the torch does light up my avatar. Graphics load isn't that bad. Around 60%. Right. But the frame rate is not full, right? So. Oh, oh, no, no, no. That is the ceiling. Uh. <laughs> uh. Yes! <clears throat> if I had not experienced this before, I would probably be pooping my pants. Frame rate is jumping like mad. Probably, <sighs> probably need some optimization. Yeah, who, who knows? Who knows? Maybe the maybe the fake lighting is super intense. I don't know. It's doing more than without fake lighting. I mean, I could try and switch it off and see. Let's try and switch it off and see what happens. Yeah. Uh. Normal. Wait, did that change the whole game view? What? That's curious. It seems to darken the whole compositor. Interesting. So I guess it's applying some kind of lighting on all of it? Huh. Oh, shh. Uh, this is big! Now I'm thinking like, did I have, did I have to do something before this? I don't know. Also, how, how does the automatic camera perform? Uh, I've never seen it in use. Access in full game only. Oh, 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 what? I still have, I still can still go here. But that's blocked off, right? Okay. <laughs> Ha! Ah. 
You've completed the Eye of the Temple first steps. Consider wishlisting the upcoming full game. Thank you for playing. And you can see... They, they, they... Thank, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. James Hunt 513 speedrun mode unlocked. I've never done the speedrun mode, so let's try and do that and see how it works. Yes. Wait, resume? I need to quit... Do I need to quit game? Uh... Quit to menu? Yes, let's do that. I'm gonna unspin my bloody cable. Just one moment. Um. Uh, crap. Now it should look pretty... Oh, I'm still dark? Even if I turned off the... Uh, fake lighting. That's curious. Uh... Did bright? <laughs> it, it turns off the torch when I uh, do the dashboard. <laughs> oh, that's curious. Oh, maybe that's why it became darker when I was screwing around with settings. Yeah. So I think... I think this might be the right direction to spin. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Uh, uh, uh. Spinny spinny. I wouldn't mind here in the start menu to have an actual symbol or something on the... This is... I look th through my nose holes to see that this is the center tile, but otherwise... I mean, I guess you, you would know that anyway, because you need to walk forwards to actually read things. Uh, new... new... Oh, yeah, I need to light the... <laughs> freaking I need to light the thing! Wait, how do you do the speedrunning? It breaks. This, yes, this is actually the demo. This is the demo and it's freely available on Steam and has been so for some time now. But it was recently updated to support the latest live. Um, or not the latest live, but the, the automatic camera thing, I think, because that was only in the main build, but it's in the demo since I think last week or two weeks ago. Let's see here. Uh, wait, how do you actually run the speedrunning mode? I don't even know. Yeah, the live thing alone makes me want to check it out. They trapped me with the camera sorcery. Yes, this camera sorcery is obviously then with the virtual avatar. I haven't seen it myself, so I will need to watch this back. Um... <laughs> Um, yeah, I I was super surprised. Vibe can't just email out start and end times in the calendar invite, 17 to 18.30? Wait, so they've limited to be only one and a half hours? Instead of four? Is, does that mean we should do the podcast now? Um... Yeah, yeah, shallow waters. Uh, I don't actually know how to tr <laughs> how to trigger the speed running. Speed run? I wouldn't trust anything. No. Um, HTC has been a bit. Hello, thirteen. Look, you have a new avatar. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, I, I deleted all previous mine, uh, pre pre previous avatars. Uh, oh, oh, we have two Chinese-speaking people now. Damn it! Chat is gonna be incomprehensible. I've been considering attaching uh, Google Translate to my chat so people could chat in different languages, and I wouldn't notice. But it has a low free ratio, or uh, what's it called? Yeah, you can only do 500,000 characters? Or is that words? If it's words, it's actually way more. I will have to look that look at that again. Um, dang it. Maybe... Um, maybe I should Google this. Because I kind of want to try it out. Because there is a... The speedrunning one is that it the timing of the rocks will increase the more steps you take without pausing. 
Uh, I think. Here you have crouch height. Yeah, this is an accessibility thing. Oh, you get an actual visual of, of the height. So you can have like crouch like this and it would still work. That's very nice, actually. Um, I'm lazy. I will probably, you know, <laughs> that's, that's, I'm old and cranky. Wait, it's, oh, it's attached to, when, when does it stop? Wait, what? Oh, oh, it's supposed to only be when you, wait, wait, what? This is a bit confusing. Right, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> um, cause for credits, you need to crouch down. Runes Govbo Johansson. He actually worked at Unity when we uh, what when we uh, visited. Uh, Vubo was al also there on the same team. Um, then he moved to Finland, and then he quit Unity to be a indie developer uh, full time. So he's full time now working on this game, betting his future on Eye of the Temple. And uh, oh, that's 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 my that's the name there. I can recognize the name. Shocking. Yes. Well, that's what I get for having double A as a as a name. I'm always fairly high in lists because alphabets. Yes. Uh, I think Thomas van Bowel, Bowel, is the creator of um, Cubism. Not sure if I recognize many other names. Probably, I just didn't pay attention. Made with Unity, FMOD, Studio. Oh, 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 special thanks even. Holy crap. I think Yuli Hyde is, uh, she's actually, uh, I think, involved with the Unity people. Yeah. What a nerd. <laughs> ah, and the <laughs> there's uh, the other different uh, interesting name. Yeah, and Rude was also part of the... Yeah, we, uh, thank you for playing. Yes. Uh, I uh, I will just check quickly how to launch the speedrunning mode because that's I want to try it. And the camera is still doing magic stuff. I'm gonna check if it's on the Discord. Um, I guess let's let's. Well, let's let's let this be. Um, uh, first steps. Uh, Play testing info. Right, Netherlands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, where the hell is? I'm gonna search for speed speed run. Uh, not remember the name of the last dude from Denmark. Right, that should be somewhere. Um, speed run is unlocked when you complete the game. Some of you may lose access. Blah blah blah. Uh, I might have to restart the game. Actually, let's. Uh, Every next run after my blah 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 blah. blah. Uh, let's just try to restart the game and see what happens. Yeah, that, that might be as simple. It might be as simple as that. Um, I think there's a quit game here. Let's try that one. Quit, quit the desktop. Quit the desktop in VR is is like turning off reality. Uh, let's see if it's now unlocked. Please work. I don't actually know how it will appear if it actually appears. Oh, I can do settings here in the in the <laughs> in the splash screens. I can open settings. <laughs> this looks exactly the same. Damn it! Maybe it's not in the demo. Uh.
Let's see. It might be that speed running, running is not in the demo, but I think... No, there is actually... There is a... Uh, uh, what's it called? An achievement for it. Speed running is not in the testing document. Well, crap. Uh, how to do speed running in Eye of the Temple? Uh, Uh, if uh, the mode is unlocked after completing the game normally in speed run mode you, in speed run mode you can build up incredible speed with every time step speeding up the movement moving blocks a bit Play it for a true test of your ref reflexes and grace, and compare your completed times, completion times. Uh, maybe it's broken? Maybe it has been lost in time. Uh, uh, what does can wh what will continue do? I don't even know. Ooh, let's stand on the box. Will this put me out? No, this is <laughs> this is the last time I played. So yes, this is where I am. Um, shit. I mean, the options, spectators. That's rotating the world. Uh, and yes, there is actually a uh, stabilized uh, <laughs> view for the for the desktop mirror. Yeah. Uh, VR comfort. Audio. Well, I guess uh, I'll figure that out until next time. I imagine there could be a button up here, but uh, yeah. Is it behind me? No. You think there would be a um, a new a new pillar somewhere like over here or whatever? Uh, well. I guess that's it. Um, <laughs> been live for 54 minutes. Almost an hour. Uh, I'm just gonna check Google a little slightly more. Uh, unlock speedrunning mode, yes, but how, where, what? Right, okay, um, who knows at this point? I'll report it as a usability issue. Let's let's go to this screen. Uh, streaming, boop. Yes, this was a uh, short impromptu stream and uh, much to test out the dynamic camera in live. Um, oh, you can see the meatballs finally. Yeah, yeah, I think I've seen that recently too. Um, that might be fairly recent, yes. And I'm sweaty. I showered this morning, damn it. Showering in two days will dry out my skin, probably. <laughs> is, uh, is anyone else live on Twitch? That's a question. Right, so this was Eye of the Temple, and I look forward to the full. Re I look forward to the full release, even if I have access to the full release, because I can't play it on stream if if I play it now. Yep, Winkle is streaming Half Life Two. What? Oh, Half Life. Two. Oh, he's oh he's starting right now. So I guess let's raid Jeff while he's in the friggin' intro. There we go. Uh, he has zero viewers, so this is perfect. <laughs> yes. Uh, he, he will ha never have had this early of a raid. 
So yes, uh, thanks for watching uh, a short, well, the hopeful walkthrough of uh, Eye of the Temple, the demo. Uh, the full game is probably much, much bigger. I haven't even done the full game, uh, even like as a tester. Uh, I should do that to, you know, help out. Yeah. Um, that's it for today. Uh, let's see what Jep gets around with. With Half-Life 2 VR in Gary's mod. That's what Jep gonna, is gonna do. He's still in the intro, but let's let's go derp on his face. Yes. Oh yeah, Cosmo Dread. Holy shit, let's go. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.